Hey, this is Jack with Recipal, and today we're going to be talking about how to create a nutrition label for hot sauce. Hot sauce is a really popular category on Recipal, and a lot of top brands use our software to make their labels. In fact, 25 of our users have already been featured on Hot Ones. Okay, so let's make our label. It's super simple. I'm going to start by giving my recipe a name and then searching for the ingredients. So first I'll search for some chili peppers, find the one I want, add it, and set the right amount. Next I'll add some garlic and do the same thing. Find the one I want, add the right amount, 10 cloves. Then I'm going to add some apple cider vinegar and again set the amount that I'm using. And finally we'll add some kosher salt and that will complete our simple hot sauce recipe. Okay, so now we're gonna set up the packaging information. I've already filled this in based on the standard five fluid ounce bottle. Five fluid ounces is 147.8 milliliters, so that's gonna be the net weight per package. And I know that my recipe that I've entered makes five of these bottles, so it's gonna make five packages. From there, I'm gonna enter the serving size and this is based on the FDA's reference amount. You don't get to make this up. For hot sauce, a serving is one teaspoon. And finally, I'm gonna enter the number of servings per container. I can figure this out by dividing the net weight per package by the serving size weight. So 147.8 milliliters divided by a five milliliter serving size equals 29.6 servings, which rounds to about 30 servings per container on the label. Once you've got your recipe set up, you could decide what style of label you want to choose. Hot sauce products typically qualify to use either the vertical, tabular, or linear format. So you can choose whatever you think best suits your product. For hot sauce, it's normal that a lot of the categories on the label are just zero. Because of the small serving size of one teaspoon and the FDA's rounding rules, it's often the case that only sodium will have values on a hot sauce label. Because a lot of the categories will likely be zero, hot sauce is often eligible to use the simplified format. We recommend this because it'll save you space on your label and make it look a lot cleaner. Once you've got the style the way you like it, you can choose to download your label either as a PDF, a PNG file, or get code to embed it on a website. It's that simple to make a professional and FDA compliant nutrition label. You can get started for free at recipal.com.